Hi everybody, this is Mrs. Prosser, and I'm going to show you the last steps for your travel ad. So you should have text, you should have clips, you should have videos if you could get videos, um, and there should be transitions, and you should have some sort of credits at the end, as well as music. You've done a lot so far, so there's just a few things left. One, we're going to cut this music file down. So you've probably noticed this thing is massive um, compared to your 30 second uh, travel ad. To cut this down, you just click on the clip, the audio clip, and make sure you're zoomed out so you can actually see this easily. And then you click on the end and just drag it down and it'll kind of snap. You want to snap it to the end of your, you know, your end transition. So I'm gonna zoom in and take a look at this. Now, you may have noticed, um, you may not like it to just cut off abruptly. So like, I don't really like that it just cuts. That is no good. <laughs> so um, that's a problem and it, sound, it just doesn't sound good. So what we're gonna do is, if you click over here, you can make little dots on this. And what I would do is make a little dot at the end and then make a little dot about here where that transition starts to close. And what you can do is you'll go from 100% volume here to 0% and this will fade down. So I can go ahead and reverse this and it fades out instead of just cutting abruptly. Now, if you want it to fade out farther back, you can always drag this back and say, okay, maybe I want it to fade out from here so it's not as short. That works too. Um, but basically, one of the things you need to do is have your music fade out. And this is how you do it. And again, you just click to make these dots. And, um, and then you can just drag the dots and it changes the volume. And then if you have a dot at the end, you can adjust you know, you want it to fade out to 0%. You should also do the same at the beginning, probably. Um, it depends on your music. I mean, my music, I don't know, it's okay. I'm going to go ahead and just fade it in a little bit. So it just doesn't cut in quite as intensely. Although, I don't know, I think this is personal choice. I don't know. I don't think it's too bad. Maybe I'll just have it like fade just a little bit here. But what I do want you to do for sure is fade out your music at the end. Um, it'll depend on your song. A lot of songs don't just jump right in. They'll have like a little gap. So it's up to you how you want to do the front. But definitely fade out the back. The next thing to do is to add some narration. So I want you to try this out. Basically, what you'll do is you'll narrate your um, recording here. So check this out. And what you do is, <clears throat> sorry, what you do is you go here under My Media to narrate. And this allows you to record your voice over um, your, basically over the recording. So let me try this out and I'll show you what I, what I mean. You go, you want to mute the video so you don't have the music going. And it's going to show you a preview of what's going on in the video. So you can just talk over that part. And you can be serious or silly. <clears throat> Up to you. Or both. Oh no, I'm losing my voice. <clears throat> All right. So let me try this. Ireland, the best vacation ever. Come to Ireland where you will see mountainsides and beautiful buildings, ancient buildings, rocks, cliffs. Oh, the water is lovely. There's old bridges to look at. You will just be amazed coming to Ireland. So please come soon. Thank you. All right, I'm gonna stop. I'm just gonna go to save. I know that was terrible. <laughs> I mean, Part of this is just practicing. And what you'll see is your narration is going to show up as a voiceover track. And you can adjust the volume. You may have to adjust 
like the whole volume. Um, you may like right here, you can actually just adjust the whole volume to make sure you can still hear your audio or you can adjust the whole volume of your audio so it's quieter. So let me see how this sounds. Okay, so my voice is way too soft compared to the audio, so I, or the music. So let me try turning my volume. Higher levels. The best they can. Let me try it again. Higher levels. The best vacation ever. Come to Ireland where you will see mountain. I mean, I could even drop that more. I mean, you want basically background music and mainly your voice. So you can adjust this. Um, but basically, you're just doing a narration over. Now, some of you may be having mic issues, and I understand that, or maybe you just hate your voice. <laughs> um, if that's the case, you can also do subtitles. So what you could do here, for example, is like, oh, instead of, um, instead of yeah, having the narration, you could just add text. And what you do is static text, and you'd want subtitle. So you just go and add a subtitle here. And we can, again, double click. We could say, see the hockey, or see the mountains. I don't know. How about climb the mountains? Um, and I can change the size. Obviously, I can change the height. And what I would do is like after you have one that you like, maybe you're like, okay, I like this. Um, you can make it a whole bar at the bottom if you're having a hard time seeing it. You don't have to though. Um, come in. I don't want to undo that. I don't want anything. Let me crawl. Ugh, now I don't know how to undo that. There should be, oh, here, maybe I can just make it transparent. There we go. All right, that's fine. Anyway, you can play with the colors. Um, maybe I'm like, Ireland, I'm going to make it green. Oh, gosh, that's intense. Um, maybe not. <laughs> um, maybe green letters. You know, you can play with this until you're happy with it. You should see your text. If you can't see it, you may want to bold or you may want to use a highlight um, just so you can easily read the text at the bottom. And then... Yeah, I'm gonna save. And basically what I can do is I can take that, copy, oh man, I can copy it and then over here, paste it, and then just, I can drag this same, uh, let's see. I can basically copy and paste it so I have the same kind of subtitle style and then just, you know, line it up and then adjust each of these. So like this one is, you know, view old houses, save, change this one to see beautiful cliffs. And then like the last one, I don't know, cross old bridges. <laughs> so, Basically, you can do narration, or if you want to do subtitles instead like this, that's totally fine. And you just have subtitles for your clips. You can also, by the way, um, fade these in and out as well. So you can use fades if you wanted to. So otherwise, it's going to look... Ancient. Otherwise, they're just going to pop up. So you may want to add um, crossfades as well. So just another thought. But yeah, that's what you're going to do. Once you've done either narration or subtitles or both, maybe you want to have like some text pop up on your screen for, you know, a funny effect, whatever. You can kind of go wild with this um, and have fun. But as long as, basically, as long as you have these main things, though, um, and make sure you fade out at the end. And then we are going to actually finish and download this. So the last thing to do is go to finish call it something. I'm going to call it travel add Ireland um, set. And then here's the key. We want to export it as a video and we do not want SD. SD is lower quality. We want HD quality. And 
it's going to say, hey, where do you want to download it? Or like, where do you want to stick it? For now, let's put it in Wii Video. And you just go to Export. And then what it's going to do is it's going to work on, um, it's going to work on basically getting this finished. And I'll show you where it will come up. It'll email you when it's done. So I'm going to just go to Close. And actually, you'll see there's an Exports over here. And once it's done, it will appear here. And then you can go over here and go to, where's the, oh, oh, it's working on mine. So here's one from before. You, once you're able to open it up, you just click download and you can download it to your computer. And then you're gonna add it to your assignment. I know it's a big file. So you will add that to your assignment. Um, yeah. And that's about it. The only, I mean, you could, the other option is you could um, export it to Google Drive and then you could link to it for your project. Um, but as long as you add your video, you're good. So anyway, again, it takes a little time to finalize your video. Just make sure you, um, yeah, check your email a little bit and then upload your project. And that's it. So those are the last steps. And we're going to kind of double check over this stuff next week. Thanks for watching.